Hello， 你好，这里是 North， 在这边。那今天的话，我们要继续玩我们的爵士琴圣。而上次的话，我们是玩到的酒吧的妹子。呃，那个那一次的话，其实结局我们没有用的非常好，只有四十二帕而已。然后这一次的话，张杰四是打我们的，也不是打，呃，要约我们的这个坐在咖啡店里面的妹子。可以想象一下这个难度要有多高才行，因为通常我们去咖啡店的妹子可能手上就拿一本书啊，或者玩手机啊，或者一个人在享受下午茶。她是想要有一个自己私人的一个空间，才会想要去咖啡店里面坐。然后这个时候，一个陌生人就突然的进来，扰乱了这一切。呃，通常这这个第一第一拍印象。女生可能就觉得不太高兴了，我就觉得这是我的私人空间，你为什么要来打扰我这仅存的一点点时间呢？这或许会是这样的情况，嗯，这边我个人认为会是一个比较困难的一个情况。好，那我们废话不多说，我们现在开始今天的影片喽。我是坐在咖啡店的妹子<咳>。好，当地咖啡馆里面有一位非常漂亮的金发妹子在看书。能够吸引他的注意，并且要到电话号码吗？我们的目标是要到他的电话号码。这跟我说应该差不多，就是他有自己私人的空间啊。呃，这个说话要很有技巧。那我们影片就即将开始喽。接下来，<笑>我跟你讲，一，你敢这样打，你你敢这样讲的话，那个书就直接丢过来。你没有听过“暴雷一时爽，全家火葬场”这句话吗？<笑>你一，你千万不要给我这样选，选下去真的是爆炸。我跟你讲，然后第一的话。说要假装在看看书，其实在猎男的。嗯，这个的话，其实这也是个垃圾答案啊，我只能这样讲。啊，这边 B， 我个人觉得 B 这个答案的话，可能会让他想说，嗯，为什么你要这样子？然后他想直接走掉，他可能起身就这样走掉了，也有可能，我这样觉得。A 的话，可能好一点。不过我个人认为这答案是 C， 因为 C 的话感觉比较有那种，就是<咳>循序渐进的感觉，你不会感觉就是突然有个人就是直接坐下来，然后在面前好像准备要跟你讲话这样子，那种感觉有点奇怪。你可能先站着，然后慢慢慢慢的坐下来，然后开始讲你想讲的话，比较有机会。个人这样觉得。<咳>好，我们来暴雷一下，有没有？一这个答案。Hey. Hi. What you got there? A book. A book. All right. What's the? Show me the cover. Ah,、oh, that one. Have you read it? He dies in the end. <laughs> yeah, he does. Sorry to spoil it. I've actually read it before. Ah,、oh, you read it before. So you like it that much? You're reading it again. Well, I read it in when I was a lot younger, and I don't know if I understood it, so I thought I should reread it. Oh, that's good.、Yeah. Anyway, my name's Richard. Brenna. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is a playful opener. Again, it can work if you deliver it correctly.、Uh, maybe she'll look confused at the worst, but you can still carry it on, and so it's it's actually got a very high chance of success. 这样可以哦。哦，他这个感觉有点像是怎么讲？例如说，我拿一本书；，例如说，我拿一本《三国演义》，我拿一本《三国演义》在读，那突然有个人过来讲说：“哎、欸，嗯、呃，你在看什么书啊？”“哦，这一本啊，哦，《三国演义》哦，哦，最后晋国统一天下哦”的那种感觉，就是你做这个事情是很冒险的一件事情。你要知道这本书他已经看过，要不然你会直接爆雷他，就不爽，然后直接堵烂，你就直接跑走之类的，哇！那这是很大胆一个尝试啊
然后接下来是 A、B、C、D 这四个事情的话。C 这绝对是不能选的，因为 C 你讲两句话就直接约人家到房间里面，哪有这种事情？利用书来做炫耀的资本，嗯，讲到炫耀这个词就有点不太好了，我这样觉得。我弄清楚关于他的事情，我不确定这个 A 这个答案到底是讲个什么东西，呃。<咳>这边综合我们前面所讲到的，就尽量不要一问一答，或者是，因为如果你问低的话，就是，哎、欸，你是不是常常来这边呢、啊？啊，对，啊，然后呢，<咳>你最多就讲，哦，我也是，我也常常来这个地方，哦，是哦，嗯，很好，嗯，然后就没了，干了，有没有？这个地方你就尴尬了，对不对？最多最多，我这边先选 C 看看，我觉得 C 应该不是一个好的答案。我看一下。You know, I like your hair. It's nice color and long. Thank you. But just one thing, I think it would look really, really good if, if maybe you, you washed it and conditioned it and stuff. Excuse me. You know, like get some shampoo, some, some conditioner, nice, nice brand. You know, and just、mm -hmm. use that in the morning, so it would look lustrous. Well, that is a helpful tip. Like mine. I will. Lustrous. Yes, I will. Listen, it just so happens that I live quite nearby, and I've got this.、Um, what is it? You know, Aveda. Very nice shampoo. Never heard so of it. So you could come back, and I'll wash your hair. You know, like they do when you go for a haircut, and you kind of lean back, and but actually in the shower, obviously, because I don't have that seat. But I can wash your hair really nice. I've got this great Aveda. It's all natural, organic. And Are you、whatever. inviting me to your house to wash my hair? <laughs> yeah. It'd be great. I want to see what it looks like. I've got hair dryer, this is a hair、first. brush. This is the first for me. But Very close, though. I'm sure it's it's tempting, but of course, but no, no. I'm going to pass. Hmm. A hard pass. Well, I mean, we can do it another day. No,、so、I I think I'm just going to have a hard pass indefinitely. I don't really understand that hard pass indefinitely, but I guess it means that you want to meet me again soon. So, I'm going to take your number. Because I see you've got a phone, I'll call your phone now and see it ring so that I make sure it's the right number, and then we can meet another day. This is actually my phone that I use in foreign countries, so it's got the wrong SIM in it, the wrong SIM card. Oh, this is so smart. I'm really, it's really difficult to get in touch with me.、Um, I could give you my SIM and then call my number from Skype, and we meet tomorrow. I don't think so. I'm sorry. No. No. Ah, this English man is always talking about Skype. If it's、oh. meant to be. Maybe、Then、we will bump into each If other. If it's meant to be. Who knows where? Who knows when? Fair enough. We'll meet again. 尴尬，尴尬结束。Okay, so that's one of my favorite moments in the game, and you know it does show a good positive trait, which is persistence. And in reality, maybe she would have broken and started laughing and actually liked you. But there's a point where you need to say. Okay, I respect this girl. She said no to me, you know, twenty-two times. I think that's enough. I'm going to leave it there, and I'm going to say, you know what? I'm going to go now. But just wanted to say, you know, you're wonderful. You're you're lovely, and it was a pleasure to meet you. Bye bye. Have a good day. And you go, and that's it. That way, you're leaving in a nice, gentlemanly way, creating a bit of a better impression. So try and aim for that. Although, you know, it's one of my favorite choices. Like I said. Mm-hmm. 那可能就是给一个女生留下好印象，然后你头发很漂亮，啊，你要不要去我家洗头？<笑>你知道这是<咳>？你知道这是真的是很诡异的一件事情。我我现在二十三岁，我他妈这辈子第一次听到有个男生要不要约女生去他家里面洗头的，干，这这超诡异啊！就感觉有点像是怎么讲？<咳>假设你家里有很多书本，然后你约一个女生啊，你要不要来我们家做更深入的呃一个，例如说书类的探讨啊之类的这种？哎，感觉感感感觉感觉又还好。哎，我觉得你头发很漂亮。哎，谢谢谢谢谢谢啊！你要不要来我家洗头？干你，你懂我意思吧？很很诡异，你知道吗？就是完全。不搭嘎的两句话，这样突然凑在一起，那很诡异啊！简单说是这样子啊。
我这边选择是 A 啊 ，A 应该是正确的选项。我这边看看，要不然就至少,至少是正常的。Philosophy. Uh, no. I mean, I think well, in every book there's a little philosophy. I'm not a huge Kafka fan. I was just in Prague recently. Ah, he's from Czech Republic. Mm-hmm. Oh, Iceland, yeah, that's where his house is. I didn't know actually. Yeah. Well, if you go, they'll they'll talk about Kafka. So. Nice. And what else do you like to read? Do you like? I generally read fiction, nonfiction. Fiction and like 20th century American lit. Okay, who's that? Mark Twain or something? Mark <laughs> Twain. Like Salinger or maybe. I just recently read a novella called A Day No Pigs Would Die.、It's、a really day、nice. no pigs would die. Yeah. That's like when everyone's vegetarian, or Muslim. Well, I won't spoil it, but you're on the right track. Ah,、uh, yeah. Nice one. Yeah. What do you、cool. read? Um, I read a lot of different stuff. So I, I like、um, business, biography, psychology,、uh, philosophy too, and I like old English classics and Russian classics. Russian classics,、yeah. such as、mm. Tolstoy, Dostoevsky, all, like Tolstoy? all the usual stuff. Yeah, I think he's a great writer,、mm-hmm. and obviously in translation. Maybe it's out, it's out. Yeah,、um, it's still very. I'm not reading this. I'm not reading this. Yeah, Master Margarita yeah, and stuff.、Like、yeah, yeah, cool. Yeah, I like Russian lit. Nice one.、Mm-hmm. That's good. We have something in common already. Yeah, I, I guess so. He pulled two down. Oh, I forgot. Really, this is really good. No, I'm also a teacher. Good thing is a teacher. Conversation on the girl as much as possible because then it's just going to be more interesting for her. So, how are you able to be free in the middle of the morning on a Thursday? Um, well, I do have a job, but it's, it's kind of from the laptop, from home, or, or from anywhere. But、um, say、like、internet stuff, and with America, so in Europe, I need to wait until they wake up and whatever. So、right. I'm, I'm kind of free, and、yeah. then can be working at home, lying in bed, lying、mm-hmm. on the balcony, <laughs> generally lying down, working. <laughs> that's <laughs>、so、nice. That's cool. And how about you? How come you're? Not at work.、No. Well, I have. I'm a. I work at the university, so I have kind of an unusual schedule. I have some free time during the day, and I work in the evenings.、Mm. Nice. Yeah. 猜大家从事的是性教育，干你的再来从事性教育可以啊，来啊，没问题啊，我们看看的。嗯、hmm, ，So what do you teach in the university? Let me guess. So, blonde hair. Oh, careful. No, no, no. It's going somewhere nice. Sexy outfit and heels.、Uh-huh. I'm gonna say you teach、uh, like sex ed, something like that. <笑>一个大睁眼的，干你老师。No, no. Well, come on. Look, look at you. You're not teaching, you know, ancient history or something, are you? Just all like this, sexy and whatever. <laughs> So you're suggesting I'm dumb? <laughs> dumb to teach sex? It's very valuable for children these days. You know, safe sex, not having sex, or whatever you teach. But what do you teach in sex? Cow.、Oh、I am.、Um, not that you, you can teach should... me anything. Oh, okay. But I could. Maybe、Would、I you, could. Will you? Have some just、ideas. leave. I think、uh, this is <laughs> this is very uncomfortable. <laughs>、hmm. Well, look, when it comes to sex, not to. Kind of blow my own trumpet, as they say.、Um, but I do know quite a lot. Oh, very、yeah. experienced.、Uh, years. Sure, you are. Years and years. <laughs> Supermodels, whatever. Okay. Lots of experience. So maybe we could meet, and I give you some of my ideas, or, or better yet, show you. <laughs> no. 跳个屁没有 Just, just leave. When you say no, do you mean yes or? I mean no. No always means no. No, like no. No, like you should leave right. Not bad meaning good, like Michael Jackson. No, like <laughs> thinking about calling the police. Okay, well look, it's lovely meeting you. I do have to go, and actually, I've I've got、you、another、could. another girl to meet. I、Great. was only being friendly. I didn't、yeah. actually want to go. I'm sure just, she's a just, treat. She's wonderful. Don't worry, but、um, cool. Maybe see you at the university. I'll pop in for the the sex class. <laughs>、uh-huh. Not that I need it. <laughs> Okay, so the real life lesson here is not to take things too sexual too quickly.、Uh, it rarely, 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 rarely works. If it does work, it's when she's drunk in a bar. Definitely not in the daytime when she's reading Kafka.
这边我个人觉得 B 是普通结局 ，C 是爱心结局啊。呃，个人觉得现在普通的女生都，呃，也不是说女生，普遍的大学生都觉得上大学是浪费时间啊。呃。我不确定在美国是不是这样的情况，至少在台湾这种情况蛮蛮常发生的。你就可以看到说什么，呃，你例如说，哎、欸，你是读哪个大学的、啊？哦，大业是不是？哦，好棒哦，哇！你有没有听过一句话叫做“读大业”，然后什么少圈业什么？哦，我不好的时候我怕被挤，哎、欸，就是这样。假如说大业，我不是大学。大学的话，其实可能在美国人心中的话，搞不好还是可以这样讲。呃，可能大学生他们至少应该还是会去上大学吧。University 这样子的话，嗯，个人觉得是 C 这个答案。我这边选 C 应该是正确答案。You teach at the university. That's interesting. <coughs> yeah.、And、tell me, do you actually like what you do, or you do it just for money? No, I really do like what I do. Great. You、mm-hmm. feel like you're making a difference in people's lives and all of this. Yeah, I, I actually do. I honestly, I feel like what I do is important, and that the information I convey will be valuable to these people and to my students. That could be true because I still remember、uh, my teachers from primary school、mm-hmm. and、uh, in secondary school. I don't know if you're the same, but did you like the subjects most where the teachers were good?、Mm-hmm. And then later, maybe you weren't even interested in that subject. So、mm-hmm. a good teacher can just change the whole course of someone's life. Absolutely. And like looking back and thinking, what years of school are your favorite? It's like, well, whatever year you had the good teachers, because what you learn is kind of irrelevant. And you're a good teacher. They like you. I think you. so. I hope so. <laughs> That's I、cool. try. No, I like it to be honest, because it's it's very rare. You know, most people just do their job for money, and、mm-hmm. then they come moan about it and they hate it. So it's good to meet someone like you who actually enjoys what they do and is. Wow, this is praise. Thanks. Really praise. Really, this is the nice thing that you can ask anyone. So well done for picking this. It's the right option, and it can always lead to an interesting conversation. Whether she's into a job, she can tell you why. Well, she's not, and she can tell you something else that she's passionate about. And what's your subject? What do you teach? American culture. Oh, what what does that <coughs> entail? So, kind of a lot, quite a few different themes. For example,、mm-hmm. we kind of started with an overview of American values, which was really interesting. Like、um, freedom and stuff, yeah. Things like that, and even more so. For example, an interesting one is how Americans relate to the future. Like it's something we feel like we can control in some sense, and like Back to the Future, the movie.、Mm, Back to the Future. I don't see how. I don't know what you mean. Okay, but Americans think that they de- they control their own destiny. Yeah. Kind of, yeah. Hmm. 询问清楚并暗示这是关于发明甜甜圈和汉堡包哈？什么？啊啊！尝试让他解释其重要性。B， 我觉得不可能，最多最多是普通结局，因为<咳> C 是百分之百正确答案。然后 A， 我是完全没有任何想法，他到底在讲个啥小东西 ？A 是什么东西？询问清楚，并暗示这是关于发明甜甜圈和汉堡包。我。我怕这是翻译的问题啊！我怕选下去，没差，我选看看。The thing is, I'm a little bit skeptical. I don't know. It's strange that there's even a subject about it because American culture. Can you teach that in like I don't know half a day or something? American culture. Like you invented what a burger and a donut and the internet. That was in Europe. No. Yeah, it was. It was some no, it was, Norwegian dude it was or the English、Navy. guy, probably. No. Pretty sure. I'm sure you're wrong. I'm going to check that. Go using, ahead. I'll, I'll use the internet that was、we、invented use, in Europe. We use Google. <laughs> Google was from Stanford University. Yeah, that was well done. You made a page with a box and you can search. <laughs> so that's the, but that's not really culture. That's technology. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. No, we do have a, a pretty. I would say we have a rich culture. There's a lot of different cultures that have influenced well, us. Who was American? Michelangelo, Da Vinci. Were they American? You're being a little Eurocentric right now. Who was American? Let me think. Charles Dickens, Shakespeare. 
靠背。Yeah. Charles Dickens is really overrated, frankly. Hmm, very overrated. Yeah,、mm-hmm. yeah. Hmm.、Mm-hmm. But who, like, what culture? America. I don't know. I'm drawing a blank. Basically,、like、you can't think of any American authors. Well, I can. What's that、uh, Grapes of Wrath guy? Was it George Steinbeck? Yeah, he wrote two mediocre books. But, I mean, of course, there's writers. Yeah. But I mean, why? Why is culture only encompassed within classic art? You tell me, but it is. I disagree. I don't think it is. I think that's a very English perspective. Oh, I don't either. I'm not saying what you teach is useless. It's、mm-hmm. just maybe you could teach someone else. <laughs> well, that's cool. Well, it's a subject, so. Right. It's pretty valuable. How can go? How can go? Some people don't say offensive things to Americans like this. Okay, well, I mean, you'll tell me more, and I'll get to know you. <clears throat> I mean, I do like donuts, so that's one thing America. We've done that. Big win. There,、mm-hmm. so that's good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'll tell them you said so.、Mm-hmm. Although, if done kind of playfully, it might be okay. It's probably not the best time to be.、Um, Insulting and teasing, so not the best option. I really enjoy my job, but there is this one little thing that's very frustrating for me. I've got this problem where I can't print all the copies that I need, and but I want my students to all have their own copy to take home. But then I have to go to the printer like every day, and it gets kind of expensive. So what do you think I should do? He 刚刚全部都看另外一个女生啊，那个女生比他 sexy 百分之<咳>百分之至少八十以上啊，可以可以可以，所以含糊糊弄他，对他来说这一定很困难。因为他说如果他很讨厌他同事，直接无视就好。呃，这边给你各位广大宅男们，咱这边给各位广大宅男朋友们一个小小建议：你跟女生讲话的话，不要试着去帮我们解决问题。呃，这是个很现实的面。你去帮我们解决问题的话，我们就会觉得，应该说，你帮我解决问题，他们不会感谢你，他们会觉得你应该要去跟我一起臭骂那个另外一个人，这样才对。呃，例如说，他就讲这样讲，呃，我最近被我男朋友甩了，呃，为什么我的我遇到的男人都他妈这么乐色，都那么贱，什么什么什么？他如果开始讲这种话的时候，你要记住一句话，千万不要去帮他分析什么，他不会屌你。你要不跟他一件事情就是，对，那个男人就是烂，就是个废物，呃。你就一起跟他数落他，反正就是把那个男的骂到臭头，反正你根本不认识他，反正你妈把他骂到臭头，他也不会过来扁你一顿的、啊。亚叔就是，你就跟他一起出去骂人就对了，骂的越骂的越大声越难听，他越爽。他听的时候，哇靠，这个男的跟我他妈的咳咳一个鼻孔出气啊，他就爽到不行，他就呃觉得你这个人真真他娘的棒，亚叔是这样的。我个人认为 ，A 这种是比较稍微情绪化一点的，因为这不算是解决问题的一个方法，这算是算赞同他，或者是站他这边那种感觉。我这边选 A 看看，应该是这样子。啊、ah, ，Well, that's bad. So I guess he doesn't have enough like papers for students and stuff. Yeah, yeah that's part of it. Hmm. I guess he can ask for more allowance or get them to share, but yeah, it's annoying.、Mm-hmm. Well done. You weren't distracted by the sexy chick that walked by, and that's something that you know you can use out there. Well done for paying attention and getting the right response. So you got your teaching thing. And what else is important in your life? What else do you love to do? I really love dogs, and I, and I travel. Love to travel. Yeah. Travel. Yeah. Travel. Do you travel a lot? I've traveled quite a bit these last couple of years, especially. Nice. And where's some places you've been? Euro.、Uh, In Europe, I've been、yeah. in Prague, Russia, Ukraine,、欸、Poland, Lithuania. 俄罗斯算是 Russia. 
俄罗斯算是欧洲吗 ？Yes，Nice。And tell me, what's the absolute best place you've seen? Like, if people who have never travelled anywhere say, "Where's the best place?" I would actually say, "Oh, so you should go to the United States. Go see the Grand Canyon. It's amazing." I can't do it justice with words, but it's wonderful. Okay. So, that you 无聊死了 ，WiFi 都没有，最赞的有吗？你最胖的是旅行是去泰国啊，然后你刚说那边，这边个人觉得是 A， 但是第一感觉也是可以的，就是请听他呃这些过去的一些行程。这边是相反的，是你你告诉他呃我在过去有去过其他地方，然后就是去那边的经验。B 的话，个人觉得，假设你真的没有去过，你可以这样讲，没关系，因为呃，不要说谎嘛，就是比较真诚一点。A 搞不好是因为我们的主角这个英国英国先生，他真的有去过大峡谷，然后我们这边可以选个选个一、e、啊，然后 C 我觉得应该没什么好玩的，我就选个一、e、就好了，代表代表就好了。So do you travel? Yeah, I do. I travel. I used to travel a lot more than I do now、uh -huh. when I was when I was younger and been to <coughs> countries,、um, Europe, Asia. Oh yeah, Asia. The Americas. Yeah. Where were、much. you in Asia? Asia. I was in Japan, China, Hong Kong,、mm -hmm. like most of Asia, and、uh -huh. I like Singapore. But probably my favorite place was Thailand. So tell me what you liked about Thailand. Well.、Um, <laughs> Let's just say, for a single guy who likes women, you know, sometimes two, three women at a time, it's just it's just like heaven. You know, <laughs> the things I got up to in that in that week, just. What do you mean? Well, all your fantasies can come true. You go to the place. There's all these chicks. Not to mention you, 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 fifty dollars. You're describing prostitution. Yeah, but it's legal there, so it's okay. Oh. Wow, that's a very yeah, shocking admission.、Cheap. The best thing is cheap, and they're pretty. Very pretty. Happy,、uh -huh. happy, happy prostitute. 一千五百块嫖一次，我靠！ Wow, that's really. <laughs> 要不要去旧泰国 ？Wrong. And I made them happy. 那小聊天室各位不是，各位想要一起旧泰国的，在这部影片下方留言啊，跟你一起泰国。And I'm, you know, very polite and friendly. This is. I'm not sure this is a. We should talk about this. No, no, no. Of course. I mean, you asked what I liked about Thailand, and、yeah. I'm just an honest guy. Just, That's how it is. So honesty, next, yeah.、That's... I mean, if you ask me anything, you can, but you have to be ready for the response. So if you ask、I、me suppose... what I like doing in Thailand, what I like doing in bed, what I like doing in, you know, other places, <laughs> a lot of places.、Um, I'll be honest, but that's cool. You know, don't need to talk about it. But it was all legal, and they were very happy. I guess、so. I just don't see how it being legal makes it any less disgusting. Um, it was quite dirty, but I wouldn't say disgusting. But anyway, we don't need to talk about it anymore. That's cool. Okay, so there you have it. Don't go to Thailand. <laughs> don't speak to prostitutes. Don't tell people about the prostitutes that you didn't speak to when you didn't go to Thailand. <laughs> and you'll be okay. <laughs> 啊！不要说你去过泰国啊！不要说你去走过去年打炮啊！不要吹嘘的、啊，<笑>不是？你知道那个？你知道这个英国男人之后在后面讲那些屁话？啊<笑>！不是？哎、欸，嫖嫖一次一千五百台币，感觉蛮削的。<笑>不是我听说啦，听说，听说我我没有真的喝过。我没有真的喝过，听说现在台湾价码的话，大概一次三千了。<笑>去泰南不是去泰国半价有没有？<笑>来，兄弟们，就泰国一波啊！我给你们去了有有。<笑>好，我们我们我们回到正题。好，我们就是选择 A， 这应该是正确答案。好，我们就来选择 A。I actually went to the Grand Canyon a few years ago. <coughs> drove in the car from L.A. 
and I think they have a limited number of people they let in, which is quite good. You mm -hmm. know, it's not like full of hotels and Burger Kings and stuff, right? Yeah. It's well, quite there's, protected. There's quite a few. Yeah, it's a national park, so it's very protected. And we went before sunset, saw the sunrise, Aww. stayed there all day, watched the sunset, mm -hmm. stayed overnight, Romantic. and then went back. So it was, yeah, very, very beautiful. I'd like very to Yeah. This is okay because it's kind of connected to the subject, but it's not the best answer because you're talking oh. about yourself and your own experiences and it would be more interesting to her. Uh, there'd be better connection oh. if you kept it, kept it focused on her. Should I say that? No. Oh. I've run out of things to say. Ganga, <laughs> <coughs> 等他说话不要，我这边选C啊。再再给他下去，我受不了。You know I hate awkward silences, but the good thing is that's only because we don't know each other too well, so won't have any when we're great friends, right? Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. This is not an absolute rule, but in most cases, it's correct. So well done. <laughs> you tell me some things you like to do for fun. Well, since I, as long as I can remember, I've always loved playing volleyball. So that's ah, something okay. I try to do whenever I can. Nice. I mm -hmm. played it at school. They had yeah. it in my school, but since then I didn't. But they play, I go to Barcelona a lot and they play on the beach. Barcelona? Mm -hmm. Do you play beach volleyball? I will, yeah. Oh, very in a nice. pinch. Are you very good? Yeah. You can do that where you jump and smash sure. it down. Cool. Yeah. That's nice. It's harder on the beach because the nets are higher. But yeah. Very cool. Yeah, it's a cool hobby. And anything else you do? Yeah, I probably the thing I do the most is study Russian for hobbies. I think A this is a little bit of your own. I choose A, there will be some problems. I don't have to say what the <笑>什麼烏魯國家什麼有的沒有的 上次那個南方事件課那個那個用用膚色來選難度那個我已經有點我就已經有點危險了你再給我用這個下去我覺得我真的不行啊我這邊選B好不好這邊選B。Russian。Yeah, <咳> you know I meet loads of people that speak what French, English, obviously Spanish, German, mm -hmm. but Russian is really rare to to meet someone who speaks Russian. It's yeah. pretty cool. How come you chose that? I don't really have a good reason. When I was in high school, I did a, I had the opportunity to do a study abroad, and my choices were France and Russia, and I didn't want to go to France, so I went to Russia, and then I just never quit. Mm -hmm. I actually like that you chose something tough, and mm -hmm. that you stuck with it, mm -hmm. and you know, like I said, most people take the easy options all the time, so it's interesting and cool that you did that. Thank you. Nice one. You know, when a girl has something that is a real talent, something that she should be proud of, something she's worked hard on, that's the kind of thing you don't want to tease her too much on. So, you know, say well done, say you respect that and say why, and then go deeper into it because, you know, you need to find out why she would do that, why she was interested, what would make her spend the time on it. And it's going to lead to interesting conversation, make her feel good as well. I noticed you have an accent. Do you mind if I ask where you're from? Uh, England, actually. Whereabouts? Um, was born in London, but actually, you know what? When I was when I was young, I, I lived in South London, and they have a strong accent there. It's like South, South London, and things like this. But um, because I travelled a lot and I moved, I've lost most of my accent. But do I still sound British to you? Yes, very much. Oh, that's good. Tell <coughs> <coughs> 英國腔啊,他們隨時都有炮可以約 
怎么看英国，然后问他们怎么看身为美国的他。<笑> OK， 逼这个形象真是他妈的极品，真的是极品。<咳>这个到底？好，反正这绝对不是正确答案。我这边选看看。It's funny you should ask me about my accent because、mm-hmm. girls just go crazy for it. Do they really? Yeah, I'm, maybe you are a bit now, but we、we'll、get to that later. But yeah, just everywhere I go, I go. Oh my god, are you British、oh, okay. in America or in I don't know Brazil? Everywhere, say tomato, say tomato, say this, and then they just don't have to do anything. Can talk about the most boring subject, and the girls just you know like this. So. <laughs> Yeah, just girls want to sleep with me based on the accent. When I travel in England, they don't, but you know, when I travel, they really do. So that's why I travel, to be honest. Just、uh, get laid a lot. Gross.、It's、my accent. That's very gross. So lucky. Very gross. Lucky. Proud to be British because of that, man. So if you want me to say, you know, some <coughs> stuff, tomato, potato, or whatever you say,、um, with my English accent, tomato. How does that make you feel? I feel nothing. You, does it make you randy? Oh my god! You like it? No, I'm sorry. That's I don't fetishize the British accent.、So. Oh, sorry. What? What accent do you like then? I wouldn't. I don't fetishize any accent. Ugh, it's a bit boring because I I can do French accent and you know a few other accents. No,、oh, sorry. Waste, you're telling me it's wasted on you. It's wasted. So I need、Solidly、to get you wasted. wasted is the way. <laughs> Or. 好尴尬，靠腰嘞！哦，尴尬哎。Although it's very true, hundred percent true. 你也别讲出来啊，对啊，真的。我、哦、他还没，他字幕还没跑出来之前，我就大概就猜到了。就算那是真的，那就算那真的，你也不用讲出来，都来公开。个人认为是 A 啦，好啦。<咳>就是有点带口音的方式去讲这句话，应该搞不好是蛮有效果的。呃，告诉他外国人怎么看英国人，然后然后问他人们又是怎么看身为美国人的他。<咳> A 啦，那 C 我这看不懂，他具体是表达什么 ？And I guess you like my British accent. Yeah, it's nice. That's good. Yeah, most people like it, so、mm-hmm. it's good. I'm happy. I was born in England and not like、uh, Germany or something. Or... Really? Yeah. What do you think? German accent is kind of. I think it sounds and... fine. Yeah. You yeah. like Arnold Schwarzenegger? He's Austrian, but yeah. Ah,、uh, yeah, but similar accent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Okay. 普通结局 A little bit too cocky. Not the right time. Uh huh. 好，这我应该选错，选错了，没得起。嗯，这有点太过了，我记得。嗯，我们这边还要接下去吗？这边应该是选择。一二三四五六七，我的朋友在哪里？在这里，在这里，我的朋友在这里。Well, listen, it's been wonderful speaking with you. So maybe I could get your number and we hang out sometime. Um, I'm sorry. It really was nice talking to you, but I just um, I don't think so. <coughs> Why? You you don't like men, or you have a boyfriend? I. I just don't want to see you again. Okay, it was nice. Yeah, it's alright. I liked it too. Yeah, I wasn't gonna see you again as well. I just said it to be polite. Okay, that's, that's alright. Don't worry about that. Cool. See you then. Enjoy your book. Thank you. Coffee and yeah. This is a case of going for the number when you're not sure that she likes you. If you are having an open conversation, if you find things that you could do together, if she's smiling, then you can ask for the number. If you ask for it otherwise, you know, even if you're persistent, it's likely to fail. Too fast. Choose C. 
What do you like to do in, I don't know, for fun, like in the evening? Because you study Russian and whatever, but do you drink, dance, anything else? All of the above, yeah. Yeah? Mm -hmm. At the same time? <laughs> when the mood strikes, yeah. Very cool. Yeah, I like going out sometimes, cocktail bars, different bars. And do you smoke shisha? Uh, hookah. Yeah, hookah you call it in America, right? Yeah, I have from time to time. I'm not a, a huge fan, but... I quite like it. They say it's yeah. really unhealthy. It seems unhealthy. But you don't cough after it, so therefore... Shisha, uh, hookah, um, cocktails, and then dancing. Oh, maybe. When you want to transition to seeing someone again, it's very good to build up a picture of the kind of things that they do, the way they spend their time, because you might find a mutual connection. You find that you share some activities or that you do some things that she wants to do, she does some things that you'd like to try, and then it makes it very easy to then go on and suggest the date from there and take the number. And do you have any other outdoor, like, active stuff you like to do? You yeah. Said volleyball, but anything else? Yeah, I grew up in, in the country, so I really enjoy a lot of nature activities. I like hiking and I love fishing. Fishing? Fishing, yeah. A girl who likes fishing? It happens. Yeah, wow. We, we exist. That's interesting. I've never, never done fishing, but I love the outside as well, you mm -hmm. know, walking in uh, parks or, yeah, mm -hmm. hiking if you've got somewhere like that. How about bicycle? I like that too. Yeah. Well, that's something else we could do one day, like take some bicycles, ride out somewhere. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That would be nice. Cool. So, before, I was like, I'm going to be a little bit of 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 a little 抽水烟还是什么的 摸她的脸<笑> 应该说女生是蛮喜欢做那种行李车业那种女生都很吃这个心理测验这一套我们真的来试试看<咳> Are you interested in psychology? Yeah Have you ever done this psychology test called the cube? Mm -mm. Uh, it's really interesting, do you want to do it just right now? It takes like one minute and it will tell you all about your personality Sure Okay, so close your eyes and I want you to imagine that you're in some place there's like a landscape, anything you like mm -hmm. and in that landscape there's a cube somewhere and describe to me what the cube looks like okay it's silver yeah it's floating okay uh, it's small like the size of a die okay cool and then somewhere in relation to the cube is the ladder can you describe the ladder uh, okay it's green mm -hmm. it's not it's one of these ladders not one of these ladders mm -hmm. how yeah. big is it like three times the size of a person. Okay, pretty big. And then somewhere in this scene, there's a horse. Okay. And can you tell me like what it's doing and what it looks like? And stuff? It's grazing, it's a paint. Okay. And it looks very healthy. Is it close to the cube or, or not? 
it's probably 30 feet from the cube. Okay. And somewhere there are some flowers. Tell me about the flowers. The flowers are by the horse. The horse is eating the flowers. Ah, that's interesting. And the final thing, somewhere there's a storm. Where is it? In the distance, near the mountains. Very good. All right, open your eyes. So this tells you, um, this tells me about your character. So the cube represents your view of yourself. And if it's very big, it means you've got a huge ego. Mm -hmm. But it's quite small, so it means you're quite humble. But then it's silver, so you think, you know, you have that self-confidence that you've got something, you know, special and a little bit shiny, and mm -hmm. that's good. And then the ambitions. So the fact that it's uh, quite big and bigger than the cube and not like under it or whatever else means that you have quite big ambitions. So the horse uh, represents your man. So it's quite good that he's uh, healthy and, you know, looks good and that he's nearby, right? He's mm -hmm. not far away, which would mean he's not on the horizon or anything. And then the flowers represent the children that you're going to have in the future. So it's good that um, the man is near them, that he's not like an absentee dad or something, mm -hmm. right? But a bit strange that he's eating them. So I don't know, don't know what to think about that. <laughs> okay. The final point is positive as well. Um, it means that you have a sunny disposition because your problems are represented by the storm and it's in the distance. You know, some people have the storm overhead and it just means that they've always got problems or that at that moment they're in a dark period in their life. Mm. So, does it sound pretty accurate? Yeah. Cool. That's very cool. This is quite interesting. It's a psychological game. There's a book on it, and a lot of pickup artists have used it. It's, uh, it's quite an interesting psychological test. Again, like the reason it's not the best choice is it's better if you can do without it. But if you'd like some, you know, little tricks and tools that you can carry around with you and use when necessary, this is okay, and you can use it. So it doesn't destroy anything, but I'd say it's not the best option. Listen, I think things are just going swimmingly between us, so I've just noticed something. There's a restroom over there, right? And wait a second while I tell you my plan. You seem like an adventurous girl. Correct me if I'm wrong. You said you like, you know, doing different things. So what we're going to do, you're going to go to that restroom and I'm just going to bang your brains out. Oh my God. No. No. Just... Well, just quickly. Three, four minutes. <laughs> I know you're busy. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. This is so shocking. Well, I know you're offensive. happy. I know you're happy. No. You can say thank you. It's going to be great. Let's go now. You're a pervert. <laughs> and I want you to leave I've my heard table. That before. No, I'm sure you have. I'm going to Really, leave. you need to leave. I'm going to leave this the is, table. No, yeah. Yeah. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm gonna, you're going to love it. I'm going to leave the table. I'll go and wait there. Okay. Get ready, you know, so to speak. You go do that. You come and join me in like 30 seconds so that people don't see us growing together. All right? So. You're going to come in 30 seconds, all right? Mm -hmm. Yeah? You'll be there? No, I won't be there. Just go. Go to the bathroom. Go to the, I don't need to go to the bathroom. To, I, want to, like, I don't need to I'm not going with use you. the bathroom. Anymore. Listen, really, this is, this is totally inappropriate and extremely offensive, and I have been very clear. I get it, I get it. You're a shy girl, but trust me, this is going to be like the best five minutes of your no, entire seriously, life. No, seriously. Just, just, wonderful. just leave. Get lost. No more. I don't want it. Not another word. No. Nope. Stop. Seriously, you're, so you're just, creeping me out. Just give me... No, I don't... Wait I, until you see what I've got I here. I am serious. You're extremely creepy. <laughs> I want you to know. Show me the... Extremely creepy. Extremely creepy. <laughs> look, okay, look, I've had it with you. I'm not going to... It's like, okay, oh, just please I take a million dollars. No, I don't want it. No, I don't want it. Here, have these Lamborghini <laughs> keys. Drive it. No, no I don't no, want it. Okay, no, fine. No. I'm going. No. True gentleman. <laughs> oh, the my. Eat you, Gang Gang.
，他给我们的资讯，他喜欢户外运动，我们这边选择 C， 没问题。So you like、um, hiking and outdoor stuff, and、mm-hmm. the weather's pretty good at the moment. So one day we could take a little trip, or I don't know, meet in the evening. Anyway, lots of stuff. We got lots of stuff we could do together. So why don't you give me your number and we'll,、sure. we'll arrange something. 嗯哼 ，Exactly right. It flows very smoothly to find something that you both like, and then suggest doing that as the reason to see each other again. It's way better than just saying, "Hey, give me your number," or "Hey, let's go for dinner tomorrow." This side, I definitely would choose A. Ah. 选 A 的话会让女生觉得哦、oh, ，You are true gentleman. You are very, very lovely. 是这样念，是这样讲吗？有爱的吗？嗯，应该不是这样的意思。就反正就是暖男的那种感觉，就是哦， oh, 真的非常开心可以跟你跟你见面。呃，我们就是之后可以一起出去玩，或者是一起做一些其他事情的这种感觉。B 的话感觉就是。哦、oh, ，好掰，我们会再联络。We are keeping in touch 的那种感觉，就是不是非常好的一个选择<咳>。C 的话，我觉得很尴尬，你知道吗？握着手，你懂我，你懂我意思吗？反正你握手不讲话，那种尴尬，你知道。呃，第一这个选项，你跟人家说很冲啊，反你们根本还不是情侣或什么之类的，你们就只是一般想认识的朋友嘛，就好了，这边选哎。Well, look, I should be heading off, but it was it was great meeting you, really cool,、mm-hmm. really really happy to meet you, and yeah, see you, bye bye. Oops, you know, you got right to the end, but this is a little bit too much. Um, being warm at this point totally unnecessary, and if anything makes you look like a little bit of a wussy, and might make her change her mind about seeing you again. This is a playful <笑> opener. 结果我更烂了是是。Nice one. Oops, you know you got right to the ends, but this is. <笑>没想到竟然比上一次的那个弄得还要低，你知道普通的，我们会不会一次节目比一次还要低？好，没关系。之后的话，呃，从这一次的影片开始，我会开始慢慢把之前的影片做一个精华整理。就是让一些觉得这个影片内容太长的人的话，我会做一个比较简短的、简短的部分给各位看这样子。好，就希望到时候会再请各位持续关注我们最新的影片。好，那本次的影片就到这地方。如果喜欢我的影片的话，别忘了在下方订阅按钮，并且按下小铃铛，随时关注我最新的影片动态。我们下个影片再见喽，拜拜。